Secretary of Agriculture tightrope as the legal battle like the scandal took another twist and as Brenda Nyongesa party of Kenya demands the Nturi to return to court and provide a full count of what exactly caused the fraud in the distribution of fertilizer. Even after the parliamentary select committee appointed to examine the issue of fake fertilizer distribution from the threat of impeachment by members of parliament, the Law Society of Kenya, LSK, has now demanded that C.S. Linturi to appear before court and provide a full report on what contributed to the distribution of the fake fertilizer. Chief Executive Officer of the Law Society of Kenya, Florence Muturi, has supported the filing of this case, stating that the role of implementation of the subsidized fertilizer ought to have been a preserve of fertilizer in Animal Foodstuff Board, which Linturi has not established or appointed such a board to date. LSK claims that the parliamentary committee did not meet the standards as it did not provide a full report on who was to blame in the fake fertilizer scandal. The LSK has demanded that the Agriculture CS and the Permanent Secretary of Agriculture Paul Rono be held personal accountable for this scandal. However, Linturi is not the only one accused as organizations such as National Cereals and Produce Board, the Kenya Bureau of Standards, Kale Chemicals, MEM Distributors Limited, Director of Public Prosecution and the Director of Criminal Investigations. Brenda Nyongesa, KUTV.